Welcome guys, in this tutorial we're going to create camera shake for our weapon. So whenever we fire a camera shake will play. So to start, what we want to do is just right click, blueprint class, and we need the camera shake class. And this is inbuilt in the engine source code. Now it's not going to be common, so we just need to open up all classes and type matinee camera shake. And Matinee is just a system in place for manipulating cameras and animating them. And let's just call this weapon fire shake. Once you've done that, let's just modify these values. So the oscillation duration is how long it's going to last. And the way this camera shake works is in sine waves. You have its amplitude and its frequency. So its frequency is how close they are together. And the amplitude is how long the sine wave is on its y-axis. So we're just going to have its duration at 0.2 and you can modify these values depending on your gun but I've seen these values quite work quite well. So just have 0.15 when it's blend out time and 0 for its blend in time. So we want its blend in time to be snappy and for it to ease out of it. So we want to modify its rotation, its pitch, its amplitude should be 0.1, frequency 10, and random can be left, and sine wave, we want it as a sine wave. And in the waveform you can see Perlin noise too, but we're going to use sine wave. So we can leave your, but we want to modify a roll. Let's have 0.5 for its amplitude, and 30 for its frequency and we can leave location but we want the gun each time we fire we want it to zoom out so let's modify our FOV isolation 0.5 and 20 now compile that and just copy down these settings if you haven't got them you can modify the play rate slow it down or speed it up compile this save and now let's go into BP rifle so what we want to do is after we have our firing logic let's play our camera shake so we can do it after the montage play or let's alternatively have a sequence so on one let's just create a function and call this play camera shake fire we need our player camera manager get player camera manager and from here you can tap start matinee camera shake make sure it's start matinee camera shake and not world camera shake because this plays the actual camera shake in the world but we just want it to be client side so we just use the cameras camera manage for the player and just leave it as local and select your weapon fire camera shake so now let's call our function so now compile that save and let's test it out And you can see it's working well in the next few videos i'm going to show you how to implement weapon sway and ik for a first person game or a first person shooter game